Binomial nomenclature is a two-part naming system based on the taxonomic levels that Linnaeus outlined in the branch of science called taxonomy. He decided to use the two most specific levels or taxa to name organisms and this system followed some simple rules. The first word in the name for any name is going to be its genus. Okay, let's write that here and you can feel free to write along. And it is always capitalized. The second word or name in the sequence is the species. And as you can see, it is always lowercase. Always use Latin words because it is unchanging and it can be understood widely. As you can see in most medical dictionaries, the roots of all Latin words are understandable because they don't change over time. And the name, uh, when written, is always underlined or italicized. Let's give an example. So over to the right, we have the name of the grizzly bear. Um, it is used its genus name and its species name Arctos. So Ursus Arctos is going to be its full name. Okay, capitalized and lowercase. As for humans, our genus name is Homo, capitalized, and our species name is Sapien. Modern methods of classification differ. Now, due to more in-depth knowledge of molecular biology, scientists now want to classify organisms using um, molecular data, um, genetic data, and scientists now advocate naming living things based on how they evolved. So, uh, rather than calling something a sticky flower or a long-nosed rodent, um, they would organize things based on their evolutionary traits. But we still use this binomial system, even today.